We are continuing to meet our finalists in the Carolina Eats Summertime Snacks Competition. We've been enjoyed getting all the different recipes. I'm here with Ingle Chef Jasmine Queen. Hello. This is fun. This is super fun. Yes, so you're hooking them up with a great prize for our finalists. Yes, yeah, so all four finalists receive a $250 Ingles gift card. I know. And she, <laughs> I like the already, little dance with it. already <laughs> dancing because we know how, how far $250 dollars can go especially now with prices being the way that yeah, they yeah. are so we love it that Ingles puts on this yeah. contest and we have so many great recipes to get to, through cindy clark is our next finalist and cindy you have an amazing recipe first of all do you cook a lot do you are you outside a lot kind of thinking i'm of outside a lot so i'm more <laughs> of a campus so normally i do this outside but it's cool to do it inside too yeah. so either way it's tasty and yeah. i love you're going to give people a little idea we have the inside version and you have the outdoor version yeah. so it really is versatile in that fact a lot of people are spending time outside this is going to be a great recipe where does this come from is this a family thing is some of you and your friends made uh, up festivals festivals oh, yeah. <laughs> You gotta be creative um, when you're at a festival. Oh yeah, <laughs> definitely. And everybody kind of incorporates ingredients too. What you have left? Yeah. What do you have left? Yeah. yeah. And you have a campfire, so yeah. you get to do some of this. So introduce us to uh, this recipe. What is it called? It is mom and pop's Irish cream campfire pie. <laughs> <laughs> I like how she's. I love the accent with that. Like yeah, that just so makes it sound what so What accent? Good. I don't know. You yeah. talking about? Yeah. <laughs> so the campfire pie. So we have a pie here. Tell us the ingredients that goes into that, and we'll talk uh, about the construction of and it. And I guess tell us the difference, too, between what it is in studio versus what you would do around Outside the campfire. Outside the campfire. Yeah. Outside, okay. Yeah. So, I mean, either way, it's just instant pudding, so it's simple enough. You take, uh, you get a 9-inch tin pan graham cracker crust. You don't really have to cook it, so that's mm -hmm. good. Normally, I throw it in a gallon water bottle <laughs> with a tin foil there funnel, you go. <laughs> and I put the liquids in first. That's key. And you just shake it and shake it and shake it. And as I said in the recipe, it's a song's worth. So just yeah. keep shaking it and check a it song's out. Worth. You dump it in the pie. You throw it in your cooler or your fridge for one to three hours. Once you get it out, start your campfire. <laughs> if you can, if you can't, we have a nifty torch. Yes. So. <laughs> Anytime you get to use a torch, we're excited. I don't know, a torch in studios. <laughs> I know, I got long hair too, so maybe. <laughs> but I, was, I have a lot of hairspray in mine. This <laughs> we practiced this before, it's so don't want to be fun. Hurt. All right, so should I just start putting marshmallows on there? Yeah, go for it. Is it as many as you want? Yeah. Or oh, you I put 24 because I'm a marshmallow junkie, <laughs> but it's up to the person. I mean, so. Eater's choice. Just go marshmallow crazy. There you I go. I think this is going to be, like, it'd be really fun, though, around a campfire to do this. Because you it think, is. what do you do? You roast the marshmallows like like you would roast them, right? Yeah. And then put it on here. Yeah. And then just trying to even get it off and just watching it all stretch and right. messy and even so, shaking the pudding. So it's we're going to do it a little yeah. differently. And I'm sure you get lots of, you make new friends when you're making this pie. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, site. yeah. People are like, oh, I'm going to go see what's What'd you make? You want to bite? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Y'all ready for this? All, all right. right. <laughs> Let's do Stand it. Back All right. <laughs> so we'll just kind of we'll just kind of make this. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. It looks great. Nice. So we'll just kind of, you know, they're not going to get as poopy as they would over a campfire, but, but they're still going to be delicious. But they're going to still have that. It's a good color. in studio version here. Sure. <laughs> and then we have some toppings. You said you put. Sometimes I put instant coffee. It depends Ooh, what you have. That sounds fun instant too. coffee. Um, if you have cookie crumbs, chocolate syrup works. You can even drizzle some Irish cream on there. I yeah, mean, you can do crazy. what you need to do. Whatever you got, right? Yeah. <laughs> Man, I bet you do make some friends with this. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm definitely coming over. <laughs> right? Ah, oh, perfect. Ooh, Excellent. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Thanks, guys. <laughs> <laughs> We're all about the encouragement. I know. Mm -hmm. I really love it. This is beautiful. And so there you have the finished product. Look at that. Awesome. This Way is to a go. great recipe. I <laughs> wish that we had a campfire so we could like right? really do it like you do it. We'll work on it yeah. for next time. Next there time. You go. Cool. Uh, outdoor. Uh, congratulations oh, again. Thank and thank you for sharing this recipe. We can't wait to give it a try. Of course, we'll put all the ingredients and everything at our website, livingupstatesc.com. And of course, you can get all of these ingredients at your local Ingles store. And while you're there, be sure to pick up the new Ingles magazine. That's right, free in the deli, lots of great recipes in there. So make sure you pick that up for all of your summer summer needs right there. That'll get you through with some good recipes. And Chef Jasmine has a great recipe in there. So if you're looking for something, it's always free at your local Ingles store.